Hi, you're watching ITV News Central. Uh, still to come on our programme tonight, a special donation to a hospice appeal close to one family's heart. It's very generous, isn't it? John Hicks knew the hospice well as he was a playground safety inspector and visited the site many times. His legacy will be in, uh, used to improve the gardens, as Andy Bevan reports. It's not the kind of donation they get every day. But the man who's given £50,000 to Acorns Hospice in Warsaw was no ordinary donor. John Hicks, known to family and friends as Jack, was a play inspector, a job he took up after retiring from a career in education. He very much admired uh, some of the play space in various of the Acorns Hospices and he said that he felt Walsall deserved better, which is why he very specifically wanted to give to Walsall. The 83-year-old died in 2020, but after his family saw a report on this programme about Acorns launching an appeal to raise £750,000, they knew the time was right. Jack's donation will help to transform the play area here and a whole lot more. On a lovely hot day like today, um, in, a, in a year's time, the doors behind will be replaced with French doors, which will allow us to bring children in their beds, into the garden to enjoy the sunlight on their face. Child can come and be with their parents in the garden and, you know, create a really magical memory. Acorn's three hospices in Worcester, Birmingham and Warsaw provide a homely environment where children can take part in a range of fun and therapeutic activities. The service costs £27,000 a day to run, with 60% of that needing to come from donations like Jack's. I hope that it will give my, uh, the, it will give the children what it was that my, my, my father truly believed in, which is the opportunity for play, for outdoor space, for creativity, because these are so fundamental to his beliefs. It's a remarkable story and everybody associated with Acorns is, was so moved and, and so inspired by such a beautiful story. And Alice says she can't wait to return to Acorns to see how her father's legacy has been used. They'll have to try and keep me away. I, I, I very much look, look forward to seeing the improvement um, for the charity, uh, but also for the children who are, who are here. They'll never meet the man who will help to make their lives that little bit better, but the children at Acorns will certainly enjoy the benefits of his generosity. Andy Bevan, ITV News. Oh, what an incredibly generous gift, and it's so nice to see how they're going to use it as well. It is. It's a wonderful charity. It's a local charity, of course, and uh, it takes an awful lot of money to run it. But uh, Yeah, as you say, as it, we were hearing, what, was it £27,000 every single day? So yeah. £50,000 is almost two days' worth. It's brilliant, brilliant. Uh, well done, then.